With more people living in urban cities and heightened global interest being paid to carbon emissions, it's no wonder there's an increase in interest towards green roof construction. In this video we'll be looking into what green roofs are, the different types of roofs available, and the benefits they can provide. Before we begin, if you enjoy these types of videos, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification icon to get alerts when we upload new content. The Green Roof Organisation provides the following definition for green roofs. A green roof is created when a planting scheme is established on a roof structure. Green roofs can be designed as recreational spaces to be enjoyed by people as visual, sustainable or ecological features to support wildlife or a combination of both. Green roofs can turn a dull, grey, urban area into a vibrant ecological landscape. The benefits they can provide are not only environmental, but also economic and social as we'll discover later on in this video. Before we get into the benefits, it's important to understand the four different types of green roofs available. Firstly, we have extensive roof greening. This type of roof is very low maintenance and is not intended for regular human usage. It may actually be rarely seen by humans at all. They are less aesthetically pleasing, but often regarded as more ecological due to the low input of labour and water. These roofs are usually made up of succulents and other hardy plant species like sedum. The substrate is shallow, typically less than 100mm, which makes for a low load bearing on structures. Number two, we have biodiverse roof greening. This type of green roof usually aims to replicate the habitat of the building's location prior to construction. Often this style of roof will attract both flora and fauna. This style of greening will be very low maintenance with occasional visits to deal with any invasive species. Typically the roof's depth ranges from 100 to 150 millimeters, and the surface is not flat but mounded to replicate the surrounding environment. The aim of this type of greening is to create a self-sustaining habitat. Number 3. Semi-intensive greening. This is a hybrid of both extensive and intensive greening. A user may wish to attract benefits from both extensive and intensive greening by combining the two. Often between 100 and 200 mm, this type of green roof requires more maintenance than extensive roofing, but still less than intensive roofing. And finally we have intensive roof greening, which is considered to be aesthetically similar to a conventional garden. This type of greening is used in areas which have high volume of human activity, and provides a clean cut appearance rather than the wild look of an extensive roof. As a result, this roof will require regular maintenance and therefore will cost significantly more. Intensive roofs are typically built with an over 200mm substrate. So let's look into some of the benefits of green roofs. The first which is probably the most obvious is environmental. Green roofs can absorb 1.79kg of CO2 and release 1.3kg of O2 per square metre per year. In addition, green roofs reverse something called the urban heat island effect where heat from the sun is absorbed by hard surfaces during the day and then radiated back during the night creating a hotter city microclimate. Studies have shown that with enough green roofs incorporated into big cities, the effect on air conditioning usage would be a reduction of 40%, boasting both environmental and economic benefits. Finally, green roofs have a large social impact. Not only does the roof provide aesthetic value to the landscape, but it can also be beneficial to people's well-being. A study found that when people spent time gardening, they had improved levels of self-esteem and mood. Gardening, slash spending time in green roof gardens, can therefore play a key role in combating mental health issues and increasing well-being. If you enjoy these types of videos, why not check out some of our other series? We have the NEC series, the JCT series, general construction and quantity surveying principles. Matrone, a commercial hub to your business.